Shalom Israel. Shalom. Raka the Yahwa, Raka the Yahwa Shai. 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 Ba Hashem, Raka Akadash. Double honors to the Apostle and Elders of Great Millstone who teach well and rule well, who taught me this truth. Peace and salutation to the Akim, the fellow laborers, the hopeful elect, pushing this truth at risk of their own lives throughout the four corners of the earth. And to the awkward listening, listening and learning, Shalom. It's your brother Shema from the Pillars of Benjamin camp here in Toronto with another lesson. And uh, through the spirit and power of Yahweh B'Shem Shai, the title of this lesson is uh, the division, the, di the, the, the division is being set, right? And uh, I wanted to read this article, right? wanted to read this article and a uh, quick couple precepts right through through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shemuel Shai I don't want I don't want to write this out but uh th th this uh title this this uh article comes out on came out on CP24 today I got an alert and uh the title is uh city receives nearly 2,000 complaints about people not wearing masks inside Toronto condos and apartment buildings right and uh immediately piece that came to mind but you see what's going on now that like you know the elites the governing bodies the wicked right they're creating division the most is putting the spirit on the elites right and uh, and on the populaces the populations of people right of division right but uh you know hotlines have been created right people are calling out calling hotlines about 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 their neighbor you know what I mean? Anyways, let's read it and then I don't want to grab some scripture. The city of Toronto says it received almost 2,000 complaints about people not following mandatory mask protocols inside common areas of condo buildings. The city implemented a bylaw in August that requires everyone to wear masks while inside lobbies, elevators, laundry rooms, and other shared spaces of condos and apartment buildings in order to stop the spread of Crown Royale 19. Andrea Gonzalez, a spokesperson for the city, said that since the bylaw came into effect, the city has received 1,950 complaints to 311 about violations. She said that despite the large number of complaints, the, city ha the city's hands are tied from really cracking down on the issue. Under the provincial regulation, there is no provision to charge an individual for not wearing a mask in a condo or apartment building, Gonzalez said on Monday. Provincial reg regulations would have to write in wording that would allow local municipalities who do their own bylaw enforcement, as we do in Toronto, to indicate what is enforceable and what isn't. Gonzalez said that currently the city is only able to charge residential building owners who are not following the city's guidelines for signage, education, and masking policy. When the city receives a complaint, the, the Rent Safe TO team provides an advertisement to, to the building owner as to the requirement of law, including masking policy, proper signage, education, Gonzalez said. In all cases, they've complied. We have not had to charge a building manager for not posting the signage. That's what's enforceable. CTV News Toronto reached out to the Ontario government about the issue on Monday morning, but has not yet received a response. Right? So, yet yeah, the division is being set. You know what I mean? And when, when Esau, wicked Esau, the bank, the, the banking families, the, the ruling class elites, the wicked, Babylon the Great, America the Great, the only way they're going to be able to roll, right, and, 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 and try and push their agenda, right, chipping everybody, right, is creating division, right, two, two, two tip hotlines, neighbor against neighbor, friend against friend, brother against brother. Luke tap Luke chapter twelve verse Luke chapter twelve verse forty nine and it reads red letter Yahweh our Lord said this Luke chapter twelve verse forty nine and it reads and and wacky tacky plantation Pastor Pork Chop they don't want to touch this pre this this precept right here. Red letter, Yahweh Shai said this. I am come to send fire on the earth 
right? Yahweh is come, is come, has came, and is coming again to send fire on the earth. And what will I if it be already kindled, right? And it is kindled, man. The, 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 the things, things are popping off. Jacob's troubles on the doorstep. Great tribulations coming. It's kindled, right? And when Yahweh Shai cracks that sky on the second coming, he's coming with fire. He's coming with he's coming with his, his as an angelic force, a, 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 a mighty angelic force. What is what is what is what is chariots? What the world even calls UFOs to shoot those laser beams, and the ICBMs are going to be shot from the from the heathen nations on America the Great, Babylon the Great. So fire, fire is coming to the earth. Verse fifty one. Suppose ye that I that I come to give peace on earth, right? It's a question now which I was asking. Suppose I came to give peace on earth. Suppose I came in peace to get bring, bring peace. I tell you, nay. No, I'm not coming to bring peace, but rather division. Division. The division set, man. We see it happening. It's popping off. For from henceforth there shall be five in one house from henceforth. So 2,000 years ago, when Yahweh Shai was on the scene, he said, from this day forward, division. I'm setting division amongst man. Amongst man. Right? There shall be five in one house divided. Three against two and two against three. The father shall be divided against the son and the son against the father. The mother, the mother against the daughter and the daughter against the mother. The mother-in-law against her daughter-in-law and the daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. Right? Division, man. Right? And the only way Esau is going to be able to roll and, and try and push his agenda is to create division, man. You know what I mean? That's the only way. And, and it's happening. We're seeing it happening. <laughs> look, at the, look at this article we just read, man. Neighbors. Calling the, uh, the the hotline about their neighbors not wearing masks in the lobbies, right? And it's fifty fifty. It's right down the middle. So there's fifty percent of the of the populace, uh, uh, of 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 various demographics who 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 believe, you know, they're they're sold on what uh, on on Esau, wicked Esau's rhetoric, man. You know, they're the ones saying you're not doing your part. Wear your mask. You're not social distancing, right? And then the other fifty percent, you know, more conservative views believe you know it's uh bs and it's uh and it's the it's the powers that be trying to um strip strip rights and, t and take full control right but yeah i just wanted to touch on this man i pray edified right the division is set it's only gonna wax worse when i say nothing yet because th the times are coming where uh martial law is coming man you know and J jacob trouble is coming man you know and you know there's going to be moles and agents, right, giving information about those that are resisting, right? Those that are pushing the truth, those that are speaking the truth, right? But yeah, I pray edified. I don't want to rot Stay prayed up, pray without ceasing, because we need prayer, man. We need Yahweh Shai. Kwame Asherala, Wa Abad Babal.